Welcome back to Fusion 306 tutorial. In this video, we will finish this exercise. Open your Fusion, let's go. Let me hide the, the components here. Go to assembly, select new component. The name here we call lock instructor. Press OK. Let's show the, the sketch 2 here. Go to create a sketch, select the top plane. Let's show here. Okay. Go to create, select the project include in project. Select this point here, press OK. If you don't have this component here, it will be a link in description to make download. Okay. Select the circle. Click here in this point, make a circle here with 8 millimeters and press OK. Finish the sketch. We can hide this. Go to extract. The profile is this profile here. The direction symmetric, measurement whole length, and the distance 14 millimeters. Press OK. We have this. OK. Now select the fillet. Select this face here. The fit is 0 0.2 millimeters. Press OK. We have this. Now, let's show this body here. We have this. Show the, the sketch. Sketch 1. And go to create a sketch. Select the front plane. And select project. Project include. Select this point here, okay, this line, and press OK. We can hide this. Okay. Select the circle, click here on this point, make a circle here with 5 millimeters of geometer, and press OK. Finish the sketch, go to extra, select this profile, operation here is cut. The Direction on side, extended type all. Let's flip this and press OK. We have this, OK. Now go to modify, select chamfer. Select this edge here and this edge here. The chamfer here is 0 0.5 millimeters. Press OK. We have this, OK. Now select the hole. Select this face here. Drag this to the center. Okay, the geometer here is 5 millimeters, and the distance here, select 2, and select this face here. You have this, okay? Press OK. Now go to Create, select it, Treat, select this face here, the size 5 millimeters, press OK. And go to modify, select chamfer, select this add here. The chamfer here is 0 0.3 millimeters. Press OK. Now click here with the right button in the 3D features. Select edit features and click here and model it. And press OK. We have this. OK. If we made the chamfer first, we can't make the 3D model it. So we need to make this. Okay, we finish this component. Now let's make the last one. Okay, we have this. Now go to assembly, select new component. We call this bolt. Press OK. Let's hide this component here. Go to show this component here, the lock instructor. Go to construct, select the axis through cylinder cone, select this face here, press OK. Now go to construct and select, select the plane at angle, select this line here and make this plane parallel to this plane here, okay, to the front plane, and press OK. Now, 
go to create a sketch select this plane here okay show the sketch here the sketch too we can hide this body go to create select the project include project select this circle here with this point and press ok we can hide this and we can hide the construction here we have this finish the sketch go to extra select this profile here the direction here will be two sides we will make four millimeters to this side and to the other side will be 40 millimeters let's show the locking here yes so and operation new body press ok we have this okay it can be can be five millimeters here sorry press ok now show the construction here go to construct and select the plane at angle select this axis here rotate this 90 degrees and press ok go to create a sketch select this new plane here we have this okay now select the line construction line click here and the center of this body here let's create a project here to make this better the center here and the center of this face here press ok we can hide this by here we have this let's see here go to coincident make this coincident here okay and make this line vertical constraint okay now select the line again make a line here remove the construction line type here four millimeters make this sketch here oh sorry perpendicular make this perpendicular here okay go to sketch dimension the distance between this this point and this line here is 40 millimeters okay the distance between this line here and this construction line here is two millimeters the distance between this line here and this line here is 16.5 millimeters okay we have this now here select a two point square make a square here 5.5 millimeters go to sketch dimension the distance between this line here and this line here is 1.8 millimeters okay go to sketch dimension the distance between this line here and this line here is 2.25 millimeters we have this okay let's show this body here we have this finish the sketch go to extra select this profile here we'll make a cut here the direction symmetric measurement holy length and the distance here can be five millimeters operation cut press okay we have this okay show the sketch two again go to revolve select this profile the axis is this construction line here operation cut press ok we can hide the sketch two we have this okay go to modify select chamfer select this edge here and this edge here the chamfer here is 0 0.2 millimeters press ok 
Now go to create selected tree to select this face here. The size is five millimeter, press OK. And select chamfer, select this edge here, 0 0.3 millimeters, press OK. Go back to tree here, edit this, and select mode LED, press OK. We have this, OK. Sorry, we can edit this to 0 0.5 millimeters, OK, press OK. Go to chamfer again, select this edge here, 0 0.5 millimeters, and press OK. We have this. Now go to assembly new component. The name here is locking Easter 32. And the parent here, select this parent here. And press OK. Now let's see here the this plane. Go to create a sketch, select this plane here. Okay. Select the project. Select this edge here and this face here. And press OK. We can hide the bolt here. We have this. Okay. Go to create select point. Make a point here and the midpoint here and the midpoint here. Okay. Select the line, construction line. Make a construction line here. And make another construction line here. Okay, make this line coincident with this point here. Okay, we have this. Show the locking structure here. And go to create select the project included project select this face here and press ok you can hide this we make this construction line here okay now go to two point rectangle make a rectangle click here in this point remove the construction line type here this side has 2.5 millimeters to this line okay make coincident here we have this finish the sketch go to revolve select this face here the axis is this axis here and press ok let's show the other component together so see we have this okay we have this let me add some color here just to We have this, okay. Active this component again. Go to create a sketch, select this face here. Go to create, select the project include, project. Select this arc here. And select the center point here. Sorry, sorry, select this add only. Only this face here, press OK. We have this. Now go to create select polygon. Circumscribe polygon here. Sorry. Click here in the midpoint. The size is 6, the distance here is 1.2, and the size here is 6, press OK. We have this, OK. Now here, select this line and make this horizontal constraint. We have this. Finish the sketch, select extrude, select this face here. Make a cut here, minus 3 millimeters, and press OK. We, we have this, OK. Now, show the bolt plane here. Show the plane. And go to create, select this plane here. Okay. We can hide the bolt. Go to create, select the project include. Select this face here. Press OK. Now here. 
go to create select arc center point arc make an arc here the radius is three millimeters 180 degrees okay select a line make a line here we have this okay now go to constraint select horizontal vertical select this point here and this point here go to sketch dimension the distance between the center of this arc and this point here is 2.6 millimeters okay we have this finish the sketch go to revolve the profile this profile the axis this axis here the operation here is cut and the objects to cut select this body here sorry the axis the object to cut oh sorry select this part of the the profile tool operation cut cut this body press ok we have this okay now go to create selected 3d selected this space here five millimeters press ok go to modify select the chamfer select this edge here and this edge here the chamfer here is 0 0.3 millimeters press ok now edit the treat and select mode led and press ok we have this okay and here we finish our exercise so thanks everybody for watching let me activate here to show you the first the last one the locking extrude extrude the bolt let me hide this plane here let me hide this cat We have a sketch here, let me hide this. And the nylon gasket, locking nut, washer, and the body. Here we finish our exercise, so thanks for watching, see you in the next video, and bye bye.